<laughs> hey, mister. What you doing? Just, uh... I don't just know if... Hang out in the train yard here? Is yeah. This is what computer engineers do these days? I don't days? know if the train yards are the hot place to play, uh... AR games these days, but I... Apparently so. I guess. Oh, and we're also preaching to the youth hidden here. Yeah, this is where church youth leaders also go to hang out. All right, let's do this. <laughs> Wait, why are we hacking things here in a train yard? Uh, yet another kind of collectible. It's, okay, cool. Yeah. Cool. Actually, we did one of these ones before, but I'm grabbing one more because, uh, getting a certain amount of each collectible unlocks a lot of stuff. <laughs> Ow. I saw, unrelated, I saw someone wearing a Watch Dogs t-shirt out in the wild yesterday. Really? Uh, yes. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> I was at Eleven City Diner having... Oh, the best sandwich. Mm -hmm. But yeah, there's a, a group of guys, and one of them ha was branded. All right. Uh, <laughs> uh, funny thing, there is a website that like officially makes Aiden's jacket for you to buy, and they're like six hundred dollars. Uh, nice joyride there. Uh -huh. uh, Eighteen <laughs> inches. Cool, cool. <laughs> Those fences were just slightly too high. Need a boost. But yeah, you can buy Aiden's jacket and his quote-unquote iconic cap. Mm -hmm. uh, that was a big thing, because you could pre-order Watch Dogs from about 300 different places, and all of them had different pre-order bonuses, to the point where there's like this huge, confusing graph released of where to go to get what. Uh, lots of places had the hat. This was just a plain t-shirt with like the, the angular logo Okay. On it big on the chest, and it said, Watch Dogs, right across it. Right. Uh, which is a real problem when you're wiping. <laughs> uh, <laughs> those, those two things kind of have to link up, uh, if you're gonna not be a stinky boy. <laughs> All right, this is now canon. Aiden's a stinky boy. <laughs> Steakhouse. Aiden, I don't know. You sit. No matter what you do, whoa, what you do, you seem to continue to be a stinky boy. Have you thought of using wet wipes instead? <laughs> get something for babies, maybe. I will never get over all of these uh, uh, businesses where their name is their description. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Have you been to uh, that new steakhouse? Which one? Steakhouse? Oh yeah, steakhouse is great. It's it's right down the street from food and liquor. <laughs> I mean, it tells you what you're getting. Uh, gotta take another quick little joy ride here. Okay, I'm done. And then about 300 people all gave their opinion on that at once, it seems. <laughs> Welcome to Twitter, Aiden. <laughs> Um, the one collectible I'm probably going to get most of throughout this Let's Play is just the privacy invasion things. Also, those people's are... insurance information. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no way. Wow. Really? Wow, that's like, that's like a cross-stitch marathon, huh? Wow. This guy you know seems all right. Thinking, he talks to his mom yeah. about her crafting. You know, I'm a little bit. Like, maybe, maybe... Maybe forgot, I'll seal 520 of his dollars. Great. Now he has to move home. You've made that decision oh, yeah. for him. Yeah, great. I mean, okay. I am the vigilante, and right. I am helping everybody <laughs> better their lives really uh, with the power of my like invisible hand. No. No, 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 no. Uh, now he can't pay to <laughs> yeah, keep the totally lights on, and uh, his mom's going to be very yeah. disappointed. His, uh, wow. I have deemed, as a vigilante, okay. I have hacked the social media and found out his mother is lonely. So I've just made everything way better. Seems like loneliness is a, is a genetic trait in that family. <laughs> I'm a good guy. Open the skills tree. Kick the fence. Everything get out of my way. Uh, so... I like this theater. Yeah. Oh, God. There's a uh, little hotspot for this thing. I, I think all of the stuff for this thing is entirely made up. 
Uh, does it mention it burned down? Because every single Chicago theater has burned down. <laughs> hey, there's Mario Simply Cool. Throughout this Let's Play, for at least the next ten episodes, he's going to be the mayor of every one of these places. Legendary funny man Domingo... What? Domingo. Domingo Mendez. Yes, I almost Domingo. Said, <laughs> I, almost, I almost said Dominic Go. Like he dominates Dominic. the audience, and then he just gets out of there. They, yep. That's why they call him the old Domingo. <laughs> uh, but yeah, like that that little yeah, W thing right, that's on his hat and is also kind of the pattern for the back of his jacket. Mm -hmm. uh, I mentioned in the previous video that Aiden is also called the Fox sometimes. But it seems it's like something they wrote out, but it kind of got left in some incidental right, dialogue. Right. That W is actually supposed to be the shape of a fox's head. Uh, nope. On his uh, head, at least. <laughs> the back of his jacket, not really. But, anyways. Hey, Looking it's the same place something? as last time. Give me some new clothes, man. Uh, uh, yeah, yes. that one. That the one, anarchist. Yes. Charlie Brown, now the that's anarchist. A good <laughs> <laughs> uh. Why, why did you have to go to the motorcycle phobia store? <laughs> like, these are the people on Mori where they show a picture of pickles and they freak out. Yeah. Well, oh, man. He's kind of wedged in there now. I can't get him. Ah! I think you got him. <laughs> I, uh, I guess that is the appropriate response to when a motorcycle clips through you. No, por favor. What are you trying to do to we're these people? Get, we're getting one of them. You are not allowed in this business establishment. Get out! <laughs> there are no clothes for you here. This, Our, they only sell one outfit. I'm wearing it. You cannot wear this outfit. This is my personal brand store. Oh, God! Everything's for me. So I was curious, is because these people, like, don't... Once they get on the ground, they don't, like, really respond to I anything. So I was like, does any of the other hey, AI hey. respond to them? <laughs> She's clearly responding. She does not want to be here. <laughs> I think that's... that makes a lot of sense. I really wanted to know, like, because they're just stuck in that state, really, do cars respond to them? Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, good. But yes, they, they, uh... They respond in the way that one lady did, which is <laughs> to attempt to get around them, but without exiting the lane they are currently in. And it turns out the AI does know how to get off the ground. They just won't do it until you look away from them. You broke the city. Oh, it's because of the skirt. She's modest. Uh -huh. <laughs> you better run. He's coming back. No. Oh. Uh, uh, did she just drop down? Did she stop, uh, drop, and roll? Yeah. <laughs> I like... Just leave her alone. She has nice boots. Yeah. That... <laughs> dude, that register. Uh, it seems like he's already really used to that stuff happening. Yeah, it's just one more story. Uh-huh. That one guy that keeps us in business because we have that one outfit. <laughs> <laughs> that we are... What? We got his brand. I think that guy might be the vigilante, but I'm not sure. I should probably I just know. call the cops. Are we back in Pawnee now? Uh, no. Nope. Okay. We're... You're in the other wilderness. Uh-huh. Uh, there is actually a little bit of physics based on different styles of terrain, so here I'm just going all over the place because I'm just flooring it. Everything does get a little different when you're on when it's raining too, or or when something's wet. I did want to point out that Pawnee is closer to St. Louis than to Chicago. Just for okay. the curious. Yes. Yeah, it's it's a very condensed map. Sort of a two to one thing. It is one third of the way from St. Louis to Chicago. Yeah, it reminds me uh, another Ubisoft game that has a hilariously compressed map is The Crew which is like yeah. an open-world racing game that has the entire continental U.S. drivable. Michigan's really fucked up in that game. Michigan's really fucked up. Lake Michigan is like ten times larger than every other lake. Like, it just kind of bulges out. The entire state of Michigan is basically just Detroit. Detroit's like in the upper right of the Lower Peninsula now. So, so it's really the, uh, the public perception of Michigan. Pretty much. Pretty much. 
Everyone, just go, just go visit uh, uh, Mackinac Island. You're gonna thank yeah. me. You're gonna be glad you went. It's the best place in the world. <laughs> If you want really tacky Christmas shit, just go to Frankenmuth. Yeah. <laughs> and also some decent food. Yeah. Frankenmuth is very nice. Frankenmuth is nice. I'm, uh, I'm sad I don't live near Frankenmuth anymore. Whoa! Their, their winter festival with all the snow sculptures. Uh, really cool. Uh, a lot cooler than that broken <laughs> wrist. <laughs> that broken wrist is not on my list of cool things. <laughs> no. It's okay. Aiden has really good health insurance. They know he's the vigilante. He has vigilante-based coverage. Thanks, Obama. <laughs> yeah. For the vigilante initiative of 2012. Oh, this is clearly like 2020. Huh? Uh, you know. Yeah. The long -term so I'm grabbing just a couple more audio files because with every collectible, Mm -hmm. uh, they have different unlockables uh, associated with them. I'll, there are, like, I'd say about a quarter to a third of the skills you can get can only be gotten from getting collectibles or achieving other things. Like, you can't even use your points to get them. Okay, it's ready for you. Hey, and also a fair that? amount of the really good guns in the game are also hidden behind this stuff. That's kind of ridiculous. Thankfully, it's like n most things don't really require you to get mm -hmm, too many mm -hmm. things. Like audio logs, you have to get ten of them. And we're already at like seven or eight or something like that. Okay, okay. I have to this thing and I can stop it. So he's. he's Otacon. Yeah. He's Otacon, but knows it has nukes, instead of being really surprised. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, God. Well. That's yeah, not screw you, Metra. That's not entirely what I'd want to do with that ramp. Went a little too fast, maybe. Hacker group DeadSec is claiming responsibility for recent attacks on the CTOS transit system. Trains suffered various disruptions, including rerouting themselves, missing You know what also does that? The weather, uh, <laughs> literally anything, a, a, a butterfly flapping its wings in China. <laughs> well, yeah, it's, I mean, it was like, what, last year where one of the, the trains just, like, completely derailed and, like, went up an escalator or something, yes, didn't it? Yes. Yeah. But, I'll have you know, it went up the up escalator, okay? Oh, that's good. It's that's following good. the rules. That's great. That's, it's, that's so polite of it. Now, it wasn't enough to drop these people off at the platform at the O'Hare station. It wanted to take them to their flight. <laughs> oh, that's, that's, that's I mean. the full service you get at the CTA. Wow. So, last video of the plot started. What the hell are we doing now? Getting to the plot and getting distracted okay. by everything. But, uh, there's... Whoa. The truck actually got stuck inside of that tree. Yeah. Yeah. That's the most realistic thing so far. <laughs> that and the lady screaming, I don't want to be here in the middle of the street, you monster. Hey. Basketball. Pick up b-ball. That guy's not good at basketball. That's a really low hoop. <laughs> He's recovering from surgery. This is physical okay, therapy. That's, don't judge that's him. More, okay, that's far more reasonable now. He just learned to put ketchup on his french fries yesterday. Yo, check that out. There's real-time lighting from his phone. Hey. Pretty nice, watchdogs. I really do want to see Aiden Pierce's ass lit up like a strobe <laughs> as he runs. Well, that's going to be happening a lot through this game. Either from his phone or because... Whoa, that person... <laughs> Why did that person collapse? <laughs> Why did that person... I literally never noticed that. Is is this the next evolution of planking? <laughs> is this what we do now in the future? Maybe. I also wanted to try to show this off last time when I was burning out at the birthday party with a motorcycle, but it didn't happen for some reason. There's nice burnout effects in this game. Nice! Can we drive the not Porsche for, like, ever now? This is a very pretty car. Yeah. That... Okay. And now he has to go for a second surgery. 
Well. Well, he frequently watches soap operas. This is a different guy. Maybe, maybe I went just far enough away that a different basketball man appeared. I guess. Who didn't need surgery? Oh no. First message sent today at 9:45 a.m. D is this? Did you find a suicide? Hey, Dad. I no. Oh days. God. Okay. Yeah. Because that's what it looks like. To see you. They've already picked out your Christmas presents. You believe that? Okay, it's the second the worst thing it could be. Fantastic. Fan Cancer in remission. Yeah. Remission, you say? Oh, this is grody and I feel gross. Isn't this, isn't this just bad? I'll swing by the work, okay? So this is the uh, other type of privacy invasion you're gonna get. If it's not, like, a peeping Tom thing or a, a married couple that's miserable together, it's going to be... Uh, the game trying to make you feel really bad in like the most ham-handed way possible. So you're either gonna get oh, dead old on. people, or you're going to get people trying to commit suicide. Whatever. I mean, yeah. Some of it is kind of like oh, rub on. your nose in how edgy I am, man. Yeah. But but Give most of it break. seems more like rub your nose in how real this is. Yeah. People die oh, all alone ridiculous. and they don't get found for days in our cyber hacker adventure game. <laughs> well, yeah, like I was saying, this game is like is just a pit of human misery. Like there's you almost never find people just like having fun or having a normal conversation or just you know and like, doing something other than being just <laughs> shitty. Oh no, <laughs> civilian killed. <laughs> it's okay, I'm still a protector. Look, they can't trace this to the fox. No. The fox vigilante only drives incredibly upright wheelies. <laughs> yeah. It's See, his I calling card. I established a, a, a brand, a style, and I'm going to go counter to that, and nobody that will know it's me. That man was leaning on a car that wasn't there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, cash run. Ooh. So this is a thing I've walked past multiple times, but we're Ooh. finally going to do a cash run. So, cash run is just another augmented reality game. It's... Are you playing Pac-Man? Uh, kind of. It's you grab the coins. Do not grab the skulls because they add five seconds to your timer. <gasps> oh no! I fucked up. If you grab that purple coin, they're kind of hidden or off the off the path. They mm -hmm. take ten seconds off your clock, and you're just trying to go for the gold medal. Mm -hmm. These are okay. These are kind of fun. They're not bad. There's like a bajillion different courses depending where you are, where you find the cash I run like things. The, I like the music a lot, actually. Yeah, the music's nice. I like the the look of the rotating skulls and all I that. I also like jumping into open graves. <laughs> yeah, isn't this great? Isn't it great that they may they put a cash run course in a graveyard? It Excuse kind me. Of is. Like <laughs> this all is these a skulls. bit where they're they're mixing up tones and and emotional states that kind of works for me. <laughs> Instead of the usual uh really bland and oh isn't this a gut punch no because what came before was just bland and nothing yeah but this is this is a cool mishmash i like it i like the little icon of aiden in the the radar there <laughs> oh also uh players can make their own courses and upload them but oh, you can only lay down coins you can't put skulls down which is oh. so that's man your, your courses are destined to be really boring yeah so i got a silver. I was oh, fairly close. Oh, if you close. wouldn't have hit that one, though. Yeah. Anyways, that was a fun AR game. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, hey, look! It's my dead niece's grave! <laughs> oh, who are these people? I don't are know. They, are they just statues, or are those, like, you know... I think they're just statues. Okay. I remember looking at them before. They didn't have any... There weren't any, like, hot spots saying, like, hey, mm -hmm. these statues, blah, blah, blah. Crime detected. One of the people buried here isn't actually dead, oh and that's God. illegal! <laughs> and vault over my niece's grave, and remember. Those are really well-balanced flowers. Mm -hmm. Wow, you used to look like a guy. Aiden looks really weird when he doesn't have his iconic cap. Kinda, kinda Luke Wilson, kinda. Do you know who keeps leaving the flowers? No. 
that girl has a lot of friends. Had. Yeah, right. She's dead. I forgot. Yeah. This is about letting go. I'm gonna kill like a few thousand people over her though, so. <laughs> We've all suffered all Just heads up. Uh, I'm gonna do that in between uh, picking up virtual coins though. I need virtual coins. I know. Have you tried that new game where you're a crab tank? It's the only thing that that takes me away from vengeance. You put us all in danger. I just wish I could be a crab tank for real. Because I protect you. Do you hear yourself? Aiden, why can't you stop? Because I'm bringing in so much money to pay for your gene therapy. <laughs> to turn your hair into feathers. I need to know. I know how important it is to you. It's a cyberpunk future. People want to be animals or something. And I love you. That was my favorite bit for Jackson Batman Beyond. Me too. Keep yeah. Him. Mine too. Yeah. Before I let him get. Hurt. When I said I was, that's instantly what I thought of. <laughs> the, uh, what, what were they called? Were they just called splicers? Something. Yeah. And that one bit from like the the fake news package, or the the shitty teen is like. We do it to be individuals, just like all my friends. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm 11 and I know you're a shitty teen. Yeah. I don't blame you. Batman Beyond was pretty cool. Me you will stop. That's what Aiden's thinking, I bet. <laughs> <laughs> Terry Guinness is a much better Batman than yeah. Aiden Pierce. Yeah. I promise. Why did they give him the most Irish name in all <laughs> fiction? Terry <know>. McGinnis? <laughs> yeah. I promise I won't blow anything up. Maybe she's right. What, while you're watching. I, I, I mean, can't change that. Yeah. I mean, even if somebody just does like just a crank call away. to your house, I'm gonna like fucking destroy them. Other people will die. You got a problem. Survivor from the stadium. If that guy talks, he'll ID you. Survivor? How did that happen? I'm guessing he didn't die. Now, relax, I got a plan. Meet me at Gorman Heights on the rooftop. Oh, okay. That is a swank statue over there. Yeah. 